The Hanford site was created more than 75 years ago as part of the Manhattan Project. From plutonium production to cleanup and eventually closure, Hanford's mission has evolved over time. Since the late 1980s, Hanford has been focused on cleaning up the legacy waste. In addition, we always want to ensure the safety of our workers, the public, and the environment. With much of our Hanford infrastructure dating back to the 1940s, our concerns are reliability and safety. The critical need here at Hanford is to reconfigure, rejuvenate, and right-size the infrastructure to support the current and future mission. As the provider of site services, we continually assess infrastructure and prioritize needs. Currently, we have over 100 backlog projects with greater than $350 million in costs. For example, Hanford's water utility infrastructure consists of over 100 miles of buried pipe, much of it up to 75 years old. The pipe is deteriorating, causing frequent breaks and leaks due to its age. Some water line breaks can be quite severe. Since 2008, there have been 77 water line breaks at Hanford. Another example is the need for adequate and reliable power to meet future mission requirements. The wooden power poles, many of which have been here since the 1940s, are failing and are in need of immediate replacement. With over 6,000 poles on site, this is a project of significant proportions. There are over 350 miles of road on the Hanford site. These roads need ongoing maintenance to provide safe travel for over 9,000 cars, trucks, and heavy equipment that use them each day. In the last few years, several road projects have been completed. However, there are nearly 20 projects that still need to be addressed. The reliability of our roads is crucial for the safety of our workers and progress towards the mission. Deferring road maintenance increases the likelihood of failure and increases the risk that some Hanford site routes will have to be closed due to failing road surface conditions. Critical infrastructure includes not only physical, but technical components as well. The Hanford site's information technology network requires continuous investment to keep technology and cybersecurity systems reliable, up-to-date, and able to protect against security threats. Deteriorating roads, failing electrical poles, crumbling buildings, and outdated parts and components all create significant safety hazards to our workers and impact current and future Hanford site missions. One of those future missions is the completion of the Waste Treatment and Immobilization Plant, or WTP. When it begins operations, the WTP will be the nation's largest vitrification facility and will immobilize into glass the chemical and radiological waste stored in the underground tanks. For successful 24-7 operations, the WTP project requires significant upgrades to Hanford's infrastructure. This will ensure reliability for safe, continuous operations. Along with WTP operations, Central Plateau cleanup projects continue. These activities include the demolition of historical processing facilities located on the Central Plateau, groundwater pump and treat activities, and contaminated soil removal and disposal. Each of these cleanup activities require a robust and reliable infrastructure to be successful. Once the cleanup mission is complete, land management and surveillance will continue for more than 60 years to monitor any residual contamination and protect the environment. Hanford infrastructure needs reliability and redundancy to ensure the operational pace is in place to help us execute the end state mission. Reconfigure, rejuvenate, and right size. Infrastructure is essential to mission delivery, and Hanford is poised to accomplish these needs to ensure future success.